This crazy looking thing is the Lawa 24mm Macro Probe Lens. Check out what it can do. Two years ago at Photokina I shot an interview with Kevin from Venus Optics, who had a prototype of this lens under their brand name Laowa. That video got around 2.5 million views on our YouTube channel, and it's by far the most popular video we've ever uploaded. You guys just couldn't believe what you were seeing. When finally the design was finished, it arrived for testing, and I was able to take it for a spin around some bees, thanks to my girlfriend's father who is a beekeeper. And also thanks to the guys from MXR Productions who loaned me their Phantom Miro super slow motion camera. I was able to get some amazing footage from inside and outside the hive. As you can see, this unusual lens design has a couple of key advantages for macro photography and cinematography. First of all, you can get up very, very close to your subject without disturbing it with a huge front element while still being quite far away from it and not putting yourself in danger. And of course, the very slim and narrow design allows you to go inside of objects, somewhere where you wouldn't be able to go at all with a normal lens. What's also special is the fact that this is a 24mm lens, which is quite wide, especially for a macro lens. Normal macro lenses have around 50 or mostly 100mm or more, which means when you shoot an animal or any small subject in, the, in its environment, it's very, very isolated from its surroundings. With this lens, you show the surrounding because it's a wide lens and it's a very unusual field of view for a macro lens. What's really cool is that the front tip of the lens is waterproof and also has an LED light built in. When I was filming the bees at mostly 500 frames per second, I needed every bit of light that I could get. And also this lens is only an f14 lens, which is extremely slow of course, and also the biggest downside of this product. This built-in LED ring light is powered through a USB micro port on the lens itself, so you just connect it to an external power unit like a power bar and just switch it on. I found this light particularly useful when you're shooting in an already bright environment and you just want to give your subject, your tiny bees for example, a little bit of a kicker from the front to see more of them. If you use this in a dark environment like a cave or the beehive itself without any additional lights, of course it looks a little bit flat because it just comes from the direction of the camera, just like a headlight on the camera. We didn't do a full scientific test on the optical quality of this lens, but there is some color fringing in some occasions that I can see. Honestly spoken, this is such a specific case lens that I don't think it needs to be perfect. This is something you pull out for very specific shots and a little bit of color fringing is completely okay in these occasions. The Laowa 24mm f14 macro probe lens is available in Canon EF mount, Nikon F mount, Sony FE mount and REPL mounts. Just be aware that at the time of the recording of this video, this lens can only be pre-ordered on the Kickstarter campaign by Alaoa. And this campaign is about to run out in one or two days. So if you want to get your hands on this lens, you should pre-order it right now. The link is below. And if you're watching this video later on, it might already be available on retail. And when the retail version is available uh, on major retails, we will put the links below as well. I hope you like this video. Just give it a thumbs up if you did. And also subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more from Cinema 5D. Thanks for watching.